motherfucker clean. Jackson Skinner, he's head of product development at Facade. Man, we must read different magazines. And the bastard made a fortune selling customer data to the highest bidder from Moscow to Tehran. He's handing it to the cyber terrorists on a fucking silver platter. Okay, dog, chill. Shit, chill. I got you, man. What's the play? I'm reliably informed that he has a weakness for working girls. There's a regular he likes to pick up in La Puerta. You stake her out, and she should lead you to Skinner. I'll send you the location. Meanwhile, maybe I'll take another look at the fruit share price. <laughs> All right, homie, I'll be in touch. I'm a sad damn bullshit you done heard before. But truly a nice person, right? I love camping, being in nature, like next to my car, 50,000 other people getting spiritual, sucking on balloons, Dr. A. And then when you wake up, you're in some people's tent and you have no idea what happened. That's right. I love it. Spiritualness is all about wherever you get your core energy. Yeah, yeah. Getting the train in a campsite with absolute strangers while high on hallucinogens? Don't matter if you're black, white, yellow, old, young, or a bit of every damn thing. Brown, cripple, and crazy. That is a path to true enlightenment. You will know a lot about yourself after you get on that damn train with a blind, crippled, and crazy person. Damn, that must be my girl. Hi there, beautiful. You want to party with me? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. You won't get down? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. Whatever. You ain't nothing. I'm out of here. Oh, you're such a smooth talker. 
You know, I don't even feel bad about it. Hey, man, I'll wipe that software for you. Ah, excellent news. I'll speak to you soon. Motherfucker Lamar hasn't got you killed yet? No, not yet. He must be slacking. He's always slacking. He's a fool, bro. Yes, sometimes. Anyway, talking of fools, what would you say if I told you some fools I knew were running a little racing competition? And as luck would have it, they got this really beautiful silver medal with your name on it. I say go fuck yourself. Bronze medal then? <laughs> Funny motherfucker. and stop playing the woman card with your unshaven legs and pierced nose and disdain look for everyone else. Yeah, you do. You have a disdain look for everybody in my universe. Seriously, I can read Come your Come on, mind. Franklin, are you in or out? Let's okay. go. Who we got? Call her. Speak. All right. Big fan of the show. Oh, uh, um, back at you, brother. Big on. Um, big on um with cheese on top. Um, Organic cheese as well. Like Good night. night. This is so exciting. I, I knew I was gonna get on this week. I really did. Uh, Dr. Hager, you think I'm psychic? I'd be a guest on your show. You asshole, move! I don't know, the answer, no, the answer is no, because, because, uh... Because you're batshit crazy, nutcase. Locked up in some loony bin, and you call me every week. You call every damn week, run your phone bill up, talking that bullshit. It's, it's not, it's not a, it's not a loony bin. Dr. Ray, it's a high security mental institution. I, I never got convicted of a crime. I'm very thorough about DNA cleanup. I'm a spiritual being. Man, sorry about like that. You. Show talking of freaks. Did I ever tell you about some nasty twins named Tammy and Sammy who had restraining orders against me after some hot yoga got out of hand? Hot yoga started and it went out of control. Oh, Where my fault? Damn women, it's a hundred twenty degrees. I was getting spiritual. Sure knows, I act out when I think I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm a terrible fright on a damn airplane. You gotta see me fly. Oh, I'm terrible. It's true, they have to scramble the jets. Listen, we're getting to turbulence. I'll grab a titty. The first thing I'm thinking about is that's where my mind goes. So I'm Get back here, dickhead! I'm gonna die when I wanna go down in a fetal position. Fetuses want titties. I ain't sucking no damn thump. I'm going out the same way I came in. Everything Don't mess it up, Franklin. And that again is the duality. When one becomes two, one is killed. In my book, Cheryl. What's the name of the goddamn book? When one becomes two, problems can arise. A study in duality by Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris. There you go. There you go. Many are called, but few are chosen correctly out of a police lineup. I choose you, Cole. Speak to me. Um, with me. Hey, man, I'm calling you from jail. Dad? Is that you? Hello? Dad? Uh, no. You know you don't know who your dad is. I know that one day he's gonna hit me. The spiritual mistake he made and come back. We're gonna enjoy all the things a father and son should do. Fishing, bike riding, three ways. Going to a farmer's market. Beekeeping, organic honey, knitting. A dad and his boy. You know, knit one, pearl two, all that shit. Gangsta style. Blah, 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 blah. 
and I can say, Dad, I made you a sweater. And it won't fit very well, but he will wear it proudly. And if any man challenges him, he will say, I ain't no sissy. I ain't no damn sissy. My son made this for me, and he is Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris, host of Chakra Attack on WCTR. Who are you screwing with? Hey, man, are you going to get to my question? Oh, I'm sorry, my brother. I went deep. I went too deep. I went, I went, I went six feet under that time. I shoved a phone up my ass and smuggled it from Jim Pop just so I could call your show. Oh, you poor man. Sure, I love the conjugal visit. Wait, wait, wait. I'm in here for a real bullshit charge. What is it? Triple homicide, total accident, but they deserved it. Anyway, I'm in a spiritual hole. We can help you get out that hole, brother. You in a deep hole. I gotta put my hand down there and pull you up. Sure, get my soul shut. I'm about to dig this fool out of this chakra hole. Have you fallen down a well, brother? I will pull you out and we can drink up that water together even though you have most likely polluted the groundwater. Like you've been fracking yourself like I'm really into sin and omen and yoga and I want to get married to a woman who will be there for me when I get out in 2025. We can have a baby while I'm in prison. One inmate told me you can smuggle your own baby batter out if you hold it under your tongue and exchange it with a family member in the meeting room. Anyway, I know I've made mistakes. I want someone I can grow old with and brutally murder in our golden years. I think you need somebody with... You won't get away with this! Someone stop that guy! Damn, I love your car. You better stop that guy! He jacked all my money! Wait a minute. You ain't nothing but a punk. Yes. Any more you mark, it's I a guess scientific not, huh? frequency. Start you piece of crap. Yeah. I can teach you how to get that frequency, but you have to buy my book and my mm, call. You know how duck hunters have a call they blow on that attracts ducks? So they There's a guy coming. My good deed for the day. Incredible, dude. You should keep some of that for yourself. don't you like today? Guys called Isaac Penny, ruthless vulture capitalist, about to take a controlling interest in Vapid Motor Company and sell thousands of workers down the river. Penny's uh, one of those tight-fisted billionaires, rides the same bus to and from work every day. I was thinking you could take over the route and... Drop the ass off where he needs to go. I got it. Good. Oh, one thing. If I was you, I wouldn't buy any Vapid stock until the acquisition falls through.
Hey, sorry I'm late. It's my first day on the job. I hope the traffic isn't too bad. Yesterday it took me three hours to go half a mile. What happened to the old bus driver? I really like that guy. Who farted? Come on, that's disgusting. Oh man, there's an up and atom burger box under my seat filled with vomit. Damn, would it kill you people to crack a smile? Did anyone see fame or shame last night? I can't watch that Laszlo anymore. He's like a man in a woman's body or a woman in a man's body. I don't know, he just really weirds me out. Hey, get in, we're running late. Well, you're late, late, late. That'd be 150. Mr. Penny, ain't he? Bear hike. Forget about it. Spend thrifts. Hey! Blame it on the city! Just business shit, you know how it is. Sometimes I... 